fire signs leo aries and sagittarius welcome to my channel my name is chelsea in this reading we're gonna find out who has been obsessively spying on you lately and why for those of you who like to book a personal reading with me information is in the description box below today is the 26th of january 2023 time here in bali indonesia is 5 57 p.m please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for fire signs and if you were divinely guided to watch this video this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same fire sign all right now let's get your reading started spirits and angels please show me for fire signs leo aries and sagittarius who has been obsessively spying on fire signs and why Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. There is a very melancholy energy that I'm getting here with the Fabric Cups. It feels like this person is really sad. And this is why they could be obsessively spying on you. Um, and then with Page of Wands in reverse and Empress in reverse, this could be an indication of how both of you did not communicate well or are not communicating currently. Because five of ones, this is someone you had an altercation with. Could also be a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Or it could be a Libra, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. To me, the Empress is Earth. And Ten of Pentacles here. Hmm. And four of ones in one verse, five of swords in one verse. This is someone I think either you've given up on them or they could have given up on you. That's a sense of defeat I'm getting here. For once in my verse, the foundation of your connection with this person is very shaky. The hangman in my verse. This person, I think, this person is sad, disappointed, or could be remorseful because they could be thinking about what could have been for the both of you with the Ten of Pentacles here. So this could have been a, the future <clears throat> for both of your connection or it may have something to do with either money or mother with the empress here or a brother, a sibling, family members because title particles can indicate that. That's just for some of you. But generally, I feel like this person is just obsessively spying, spying on you because they can't move on. Eight of Cups here more verse. Again, very sad energy, five of cups. This person is really sad. I think because both of you had a fight or some misunderstandings or both of you may have lived in the same house together or maybe could have been in a relationship or a friendship or it could be a family member, okay? It can be any of these type of, any, any sorts of relationships, but... I just feel like the main reason why this person is obsessively spying you because they are starting to realize something. They're seeing things in a different perspective. Things didn't work out between the two of you. There's a lot of like this energy of I'm stuck, I can't move on from this, and I feel defeated. Now we're no longer connected or our connection is very shaky. And foul ones again could have been a, some sort of a drama that both of you have had with each other. Let's see more. They're spying on you either by asking friends with a judgment, it could indicate that, or the will of fortune online. Um, if you have social media, sometimes you know, for those of you who don't have any social media, they could be. A form of spying could also be getting a tarot reading read. Sorry, somebody's coughing and it's outside my door. Um, it could be like what you're doing right now, watching a tarot video, but also could be just looking back at pictures, looking back at conversations, past conversations, because the judgment can indicate something from the past. 
um, could be also online with the Will Fortune here if you have um, a, a, any social media, okay? We've got the Nine of Pentacles here. This person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus. Two of Cups. I feel like for some of you, there could be a couple of people spying on you currently. One could be an ex, someone from your past, or an old friend from your past. Again, there could have been, whatever the case is, a Five of Wands here. It feels like both of you had a fight or an argument uh, in the past. And the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Candy Cake could be a friend. Um, and or an X, Seven of Pentacles is right here. This person is, has been waiting for you or observing you. There's a lot of ob observation going on. I think a lot of recalling, um, thinking about the past and uh, definitely this person is sad. I don't see it as like someone being malicious towards you and that's why they're obsessively spying on you. But I think the main reason why this person is buying on you is because they're just really disappointed either on themselves or on you again it could go vice versa but something that was being said i feel two pages here in reverse something that was being said or something that was being done could be and you know i'm sensing it's like an argument you had an argument with this person yeah for sure and some of you could be a, your mom, <laughs> empress, the mother figure, okay? Or it could, again, be a friend here. But there is someone else, fire signs, one more person, whom either, especially if this person lives a ways away from you, lives far away from you, okay? And this person may have feelings for you and cares about you. Again, it could be a friend, or it could be somebody who could be romantically interested in you. And if you're in a long distance relationship, you may have that one person currently obsessively spying on you. I think this person seems really interested um, and not just interested in anything, but it just sends a very genuine energy here. That's one person very genuine about you or about this friendship or this connection or this relationship. And it feels far, far away, Wheel of Fortune. This person could be living far away from you. Unless it's the same person who's trying to see if both of you could have a chance for a reconciliation. Okay, that's just for some of you. Hmm. Let's pull out a few of these oracles. I want you. Some of you, it is, it is this one person here who could be romantically um, interested in you. And I think... Yeah, but the intention is good though. I think this person really wants to commit or want a commitment with you, unless it's a, a friend. I wish I had treated you better. This is an ex or someone from your past. I don't react when people mention you. And then we've got, I want to be more than friends. See, this is that friend, like, I don't know. Some of you may have friend zone this person. Also, there's someone you could have friend zone who could be spying on you, obsessively spying on you because this person wants you so much. Hmm. I feel like if they could forge a bond or a relationship or or yeah, I would say a committed relationship with you, then it would be, they would be the luckiest person on earth. That's what I'm sensing here. Want to feel that way again. We've got to hide behind material things. I do see one person here again. I feel like there are at least two people here, fire signs. You have this like a past person. Again, I feel they could be reminiscing about the past with the judgment here. Um, thinking about you, thinking about what you used to give them with the Empress Emma first. They could be hiding and not wanting you to know that they could be thinking a lot about you, missing you. Mm -hmm. This person is missing you. I think this is someone either you could have talked about the future together, but 
you know, feels like there's some sort of disappointments in regards to the future here. Maybe they thought they could have a future with you, but it just didn't happen that way. Or you thought you could have a future with them, but it didn't happen because a lot of disappointments, again, surrounding this energy. Yeah, this person could be regretting the way they treated you here in the past. And then you've got one more person who could be relatively new or be... Some of you, it's like friends with benefits kind of thing. Or if it's not, it's a friend who has like a crush on you or somebody who wants to just be more than friends. If it's someone relatively new, maybe it hasn't come to that point yet, yet where it's official. That's for some of you, yeah. And also a long distance relationship I'm sensing here. Uh, or a friendship all right fire signs leo aries sagittarius is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe if you'd like to watch more of these videos that i post almost every single day sometimes even twice a day they're all very new very uh, fresh because i upload them right away once i'm done with all the readings and there are different topics different questions um yeah and it's just they're all short readings like 10 minutes each or a little bit more yeah check them out if you want to you can go ahead and binge watch if you want to and also um it's on the daily readings um playlist if you can't see it on a screen you can go to videos and scroll all the way down you can you can look for your sign or any 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 reading that you may be drawn to okay and then there's one more playlist that i'm leaving you on the screen right now and it's from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel check that one out too if you want to last but not least i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information <clears throat> is in the description box below um yeah, I've added a few options, and if you have any other questions, you can just email me, all right? Take care, fire signs. Leo, Aries, and Sash. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Bye.